John C. Prima, born January 12, 1813 in Georgia, was a former military man, explorer, teacher of mathematics, civil engineer assistant, senator of California, and governor of Arizona. But he was most known for being nominated as the Republican candidate for president in the election of 1856. It almost seems as if Fremont was just as much of an explorer as he was a politician, having explored between the Missouri River and the northern U.S. border and searched for a route from the Mississippi River to the Pacific Ocean. He was also a second lieutenant of topographical engineers in the U.S. Army, but he was just as involved in politics. Fremont was not involved in the Kansas-Nebraska Act, but was anti-slavery, which was part of why he was nominated to be the Republican candidate. His big competitor in the election, the Democratic candidate, James Buchanan, also was not involved with Kansas-Nebraska, but supported the Compromise of 1850. The Republican Party wanted to stop the expansion of slavery, winning Fremont lots of support in the North. However, Buchanan won just as much support in the South and some in the North. With 174 electoral votes, Buchanan won the election of 1856. Fremont got 114 electoral votes, and Fillmore, the candidate from the New Nothing Party, got only 8 electoral votes. Though he lost the election, Fremont's determination didn't end. He later became a major general in the U.S. Army and ran for president again in 1864 for the Republican Party. But he soon withdrew from the election, realizing his lack of fans couldn't possibly lead to a win. He had his last shot at politics from 1878 to 1881, when he was the governor of Arizona. He died on July 13, 1890.